Okay, that's for another four foot tank. <clears throat> that's gonna have some uh, SPS on this shelf here, going off so for on some of the branching <clears throat> to different layers. And the tank goes up another uh, six inches from there, so lots of room for SPS to grow on. And it's like a ledge on this side here, and then on the shelf here, too, or on the branch, I should say. And lots of intertwined branching in between for the fish and for corals to grow on. SPS or mostly LPS on the bottom section here, and maybe some softies, if anything, but mostly SPS on the top. And you got a full overhang that goes all the way from one end to the other end of the tank, pretty much just about a foot and a half away. And you could put like a nice little piece of rock here, if anything, this with lots of holes in it. So just either just to offset the look of the big empty gap in the back could be put back here or further back in the tank or it could be just simply removed away. And on this side here, the same thing, small little piece of uh, Pocani sitting up top here just on itself by itself. And another piece back there with lots of holes in that one for different kinds of corals, whether it just gives it a 3D look to the tank just because it sits a little further back on the back side of the tank. Could be moved further away or closer out to the end of the tank and this is pretty much the end of the tank here. You have about six inches of difference here so lots of plenty of room for the, for the tank to be viewed from this angle and from the front angle of the tank.